people want to know what they can expect over time. I think that's that's an obvious, uh, you know, very understandable question, first question. And uh, I, I generally spend the first few minutes explaining that I expect, given my good health over time, to be able to be interacting with the patient or their child over the next 60 or 70 years. Uh, that's a real important message. Um, the fact that people aren't alone is really important. Many physicians haven't heard about Marfan syndrome. Many people who are newly diagnosed have never heard of Marfan syndrome and uh, really have a feeling of isolation, of, of loneliness, of, of uh, drifting in the dark on a new journey all alone. Um, that is uh, simply not the case. Um, there are many excellent medical facilities for the care of people with Marfan syndrome. There is a tremendous support group called the National Marfan Foundation that has excellent educational materials that uh, provides many opportunities for patients and families to meet each other, to talk about obstacles, to talk about strategies to overcome obstacles. Uh, so really it is a very nurturing community uh, that will welcome someone who's newly diagnosed with Marfan syndrome.